Hi friends, in this video, I'm gonna make an AC frequency meter using Arduino and a few more components. With this meter, we can measure high voltage frequency signals. So without further ado, let's start this video. If you are not subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon so you can get notified about my new videos. Follow me on Facebook and Instagram. I have a second channel Canny Tech, do check it out as well, subscribe and support it. All the links are in the description. So these are all the components we are gonna need for this project. First, I'm gonna connect Arduino, then I'm gonna connect LM358 IC and connect its pin number 8 to 5 volt pin of Arduino, its pin number 4 to ground and its pin number 7 to A1 pin of Arduino. Then I'm gonna connect a 10k resistor and connect its one pin to pin number 7 of the IC and its other pin to pin number 6 of the IC. Then I'm gonna connect a 4.7k resistor and connect its one pin to pin number 6 of the IC and its other pin to ground. Then I'm gonna connect a 2.2k resistor and connect its one pin to pin number 5 of the IC and its other pin to ground. Then I'm gonna connect a 2 pin terminal block. Then I'm gonna connect a 470k resistor and connect its one pin to pin number 5 of the IC. Then I'm gonna connect another 470k resistor and connect its one pin to remaining pin of the previous 470k resistor. Then I'm gonna connect another 470k resistor and connect its one pin to previous 470k resistor and its other pin to one pin of the two pin terminal block. Then I'm gonna connect a 470k resistor and connect its one pin to ground. Then I'm gonna connect another 470k resistor and connect its one pin to remaining pin of the previous 470k resistor. Then I'm gonna connect a 470k resistor and connect its one pin to remaining pin of the previous 470k resistor and its other pin to remaining pin of the 2 pin terminal block. Then I'm gonna connect the LCD display and connect its pin number 1, 5, 7, 8, 9, 10 and 16 to ground and its pin number 2 and 15 to 5 full pin of Arduino, its pin number 4 to D7 pin of Arduino its pin number 6 to D6 pin of Arduino, its pin number 11 to D5 pin of Arduino, its pin number 12 to D4 pin of Arduino, its pin number 13 to D3 pin of Arduino, its pin number 14 to D2 pin of Arduino. Then I'm gonna connect a 10k trim pot and connect its one side pin to 5 volt pin of Arduino, its center pin to pin number 3 of the LCD and its other side pin to ground. So we have completed all the connections, now let's upload the code to Arduino and test the project. Mm -hmm. 